Today we're going to talk about varicose heal. Varicose heal, a condition that men may get diagnosed after a simple sports physical in high school. A varicose heal is a group of swollen veins inside the scrotum. The scrotum, remember, is the skin sac that holds the testicles. These changes in the veins of the, of the scrotum can happen at any age, but it is present in 15 to 20 percent of males in, in, in the general population. So let's talk about the symptoms of a varicocele. Varicocele may be asymptomatic, that is, it may present, present with no symptoms at all, or it could have some of the following symptoms. Sometimes patients may present with dull, kind of aching, usually left-sided scrotal pain. It is typically more noticeable when they are standing and it gets better when they're laying down. Atrophy of the left testicle can happen and that, that seems to be secondary to, to a damage of the testicle because of the increased temperature in the scrotum. When the blood vessels get congested, they increase the temperature inside the scrotum on that side and that can lead to damage on the testicle. Sometimes a varicocele can cause problems with fertility. If this happens, you actually might not be able to get a partner pregnant. Is there any test for a varicocele? Well, not usually. If you have a swelling that feels like a varicocele, usually your, your physician, your medical provider will probably be able to tell that by just doing an examination and asking you about your symptoms. Now, if they have any uncertainty about the diagnosis, they might order an ultrasound test. And this uses simply sound waves to create pictures of the inside of your body to get an idea of the distension or the engorgement of those vessels inside the scrotum. It is important to know that varicoceles usually happen on the left side. 33% of the patients may have it in both sides, but when it is only on one side, particularly on the right side, uh, usually they are not common, and they should alert the physician or the person doing the examination for you about possible underlying problems that are causing some compression of the veins up in your belly. Therefore, in those instances, you might end up needing a CT scan of your abdomen for further evaluation and additional testing. So how do we treat a varicocele? Well, first of all, it's important to know that varicoceles don't need to be treated all the time. You know, mostly uh, the varicoceles that are treated uh, are treated because of the discomfort that the patient has or because they're having difficulties getting their partner pregnant. So the use of pain medications such as ibuprofen, which is the same thing as Advil or Motrin, uh, can be used, particularly if the varicocele is causing discomfort. Wearing tight underwear or an athletic supporter like a jock strap to support the scrotum can be helpful as well. And in cases where definitive treatment is required, surgery will stop the blood from flowing into the swollen veins in the scrotum. So therefore, you will need to go to the operating room. So these are the five things that I want you to remember about varicoceles. One, a varicocele is a group of swollen veins in the scrotum. It is a very common, mostly on the left side. It may not present with symptoms, although some mild symptoms can be present. The diagnosis is made mostly by examination and occasionally by ultrasound. And finally, the treatment depends on the symptoms that you have.